Hello, this is the Clueless Bartender and today, gagawa tayo ng Old Fashioned. Maraming ways na pwedeng gawin ng Old Fashioned. Pwede kang gumamit ng rum, whiskey, or gin. Pero today, ang gagawin natin is yung original kind of Old Fashioned gamit ang whiskey. Pero bago tayo gumawa ng old fashion, alamin muna natin kung ano ito. Ang old fashion, apat na ingredient lang yan. The four ingredients are aromatic bitters, whiskey, sugar, and of course, water. Na manggagaling dun sa ice na ilalagay natin sa cocktail. The old fashion is one of the earliest cocktails ever invented. Uh, na-develop ito noong early 1800s. Noong time na yon hindi pa old-fashioned ang tawag sa kanya. Pag sinabi mong cocktail, yun lang talaga yun. Uh, bitter, spirits, water, and sugar. Those four ingredients make up what a cocktail is during that time. 1800s. Early 1800s. And then later on, as, as bartending developed, Naka-invento na sila, nagdagdag na sila ng mga iba-iba pang ingredients like absinthe, curacao, and other uh, flavored spirits. That was around 1860s, 1870s. Ang mga cocktails nun, nagiging complicated na. Marami ng mga flavors. And then during that time, around 1870s sa New York, somebody said, Make me a cocktail the old-fashioned way. When he said that, the old-fashioned way, ang ibig niya sabihin is yung old-fashioned na ginagawa nung mga early 1800s. Okay? Four ingredients. Aromatic bitters, whiskey, sugar, and ice. Doon na nagkaroon ng label yung cocktail na to. Kaya siya tinawag na old-fashioned. Okay, ang ingredients na gagamitin natin today ay aromatic bitters. These aromatic bitters, uh, this is homemade. Ako mismo ang gumawa nito. If you want to watch or to know kung paano ko ito ginawa, uh, I'll put a link below or somewhere in this frame. And then for our whiskey, ang gagamitin natin, Embassy. 65 proof. Yung iba, ginagamit nila bourbon, uh, yung mga mamahaling whiskey. Ito lang ang kaya natin eh. So, embassy tayo. Normal white sugar. The original recipe calls for sugar cubes. Pero wala tayong sugar cubes, so normal white sugar. And then of course, ice. Okay, game. This is a type of cocktail na sa baso mismo pinibiyag ang ingredients. One teaspoon of sugar. One teaspoon of aromatic bitters. Ganyan lang talaga kakonti ang paggamit sa aromatic bitters. Patak-patak lang. Kasi malakas ang flavors nito. Magkakat tayo ng orange. Ihahalo natin dun sa bitters at saka sa sugar. And then dudurugin natin yung sugar para humalo dun sa mga bitters at saka sa mga oil. Ang susunod natin ilalagay, yellow.
two shots of whiskey. Tapos, isi-steer na natin siya. Ayaw mag-cooperate ng yelo. Ayaw niya umikot. And then for the garnish, maghihiwa tayo ng balat ng orange. Make sure na balat lang ang makukuha nyo. Huwag nyo rin sasama yung puti. Iti-twist natin sa ibabaw ng baso. Kasi may mga coils ang balat ng orange. May mga coils yun. Uh, Pag tiniga mo, tatal six sila dun sa loob ng baso. Yeah. It adds to the flavor of it. Okay. Um, pwede yung ihulog na lang itong balat ng orange dyan sa cocktail. Pwede ng garnish yun. But uh, ngayon, itatry natin gumawa ng mas elaborate na... Hindi naman elaborate. Try natin gumawa ng mas presentable na garnish. Okay, twist the orange. So, we natin ang stick. I don't know what I'm doing. Wala. Wala. Wala yung shape yan. Gawin natin parang ribbon. Okay, you know what? Ayusin natin yung uh, edges ng orange. Pantayin natin. Gawa tayo parang ribbon. By the way, habang ginagawa natin ito, natutunaw yung yelo. At yung tubig na natunaw ng yelo, yun na yung humahado dun sa kape. It adds to the ingredient. What it does, it it kinda dilutes the the strong taste na galing dun sa bitter at saka sa whiskey. Lagyan natin yung cherry. And that's it. This is my old fashioned. I feel like a gentleman from 1860s. Thank you for liking and subscribing. This is the Clueless Bartender. See you next episode. Cheers.